Adelaide's finals ambitions go on the line tonight as they look to ensure a season full of promise gets rewarded. I don't want that to reach double figures. Goodwin bending towards Halloran. Parkinson going up to Rigo, and what a save from Margush. Rigo finding Lopez is going to shoot from range again and draw another outstanding save from Margush. And it's at the same, the same area, the same near post. Interesting, Robbie. Haller and great link up with Ryan Strain, and it's in off Siggy Gordon. Just the start the Reds were after as they look to make it back into the finals in season 15 of the A-League. Well, they get a goal that their start deserves. Absolutely dominant in this opening 10 minutes. And his wait for an A-League goal is likely to go on. The ground announcer just announced it as an own goal, and you could see the reaction there of Ryan Strain. He, he's waited so long, and he looks so puzzled. Uh, I'm not sure he's happy, but I think the, the ground announcer might have got that one right. Do you remember that match? And you remember what the handball was for, because what the red card was for, I just gave it away. We'll come back to you after this raid from Wanderers. Aquilina and Kamau deflection off Strain, would you believe? And it's 1-1. What a strange night at Cooper Stadium. And beats everyone. Ziggy Gordon in a foot race with Haller, and he's not going to win that, but he's diving in and winning his side a throw. Bacchus trying to beat Lopez. Now Gordon, dangerous, good punch from Delianov, but only as far as Bacchus. Who's whipping it in again. Now Dorans, 2-1 Wanderers. What a turnaround in Adelaide. Just his fourth of the campaign. Across Delinov is no chance. That is as sweet as you like. Brilliant finish from Dorans. Adelaide United in the NPL a week and a half ago. Oh, that's a bad tackle. I think you'll get away with the yellow. Mutakoudis, the man in question, and the colour of the card is red for Tas Mutakoudis. This match takes another twist. Straight ball. Oh, yeah, he's got to go. Looking at it from the angle when it, in real time, I didn't see that stud up like that. He's got to go for that. It's an easy decision for the referee. That is reckless. Beanie now feeding Aquilina. He is speedy and he's hit the apex. How close was that to 3 1 for Wanderers? Well, you don't go much closer. What a strike. Urich fed quickly. More cool. It's a collision and it's all the way to Craig Goodwin. Oh, what a save from Margush. It was swerved. And he's in a little bit of trouble. The Wanderers keep up. Well, such was the force he hit it with. The ball moved all over the place. He gets away from Wilmering, who returns. Not giving him any space. Dorigo. Halloran. And good one! Well, in the big games, the big names stand. They'll, they'll want to get push up into third. Urich. Urich! So close to the lead, the Reds. Now Ryan Strain. How about this action? Strain now. He's won his side a corner. Wow. This game just keeps on delivering tonight. Into the top three it would be, and potentially lock down a home final if they can grab a third. It's so key, especially considering the Reds have lost just twice at home this season. Problems much. What a save from Delianov to deny Jordan much after 
what appeared to be an oncoming disaster. And just slightly behind Goodwin and just broke down for a moment. That's a lovely ball. Cavallo back post, side netting. Was those couple of changes? But it's confirmed now the Reds return to the finals in season 15 of the A League. It's not quite the way they would have liked to qualify as they miss a home final, but a spot in the playoffs is secured for Carl Viet's side.